Hi, Jason Ganahl, TQ Barbecue. Do you want to make a better smash burger? It's coming up right now. With burgers, the minimum amount of fat ratio is 80-20 for me. You can see a lot of that white in this ground beef. That indicates a lot of fat, and you know fat is where it's at. I'm gonna loosely form patties anywhere from two and a half to three ounces. We're gonna hit these smash burgers with my go-to all-purpose seasoning, one-third salt, one-third fresh ground pepper, and one-third GQ barbecue the rub. The spread for today's burger, take four parts mayonnaise, two parts your favorite mustard, mine's spicy brown, and a squeeze of lemon juice. If you want to see how to avoid getting seeds in your spread, watch that Surf and Turf Burger video. I'll put a link to that down in the comments. Press and hold for five seconds. In the bacon jam recipe video, I asked you to tell me what you think the bacon jam would taste great on. We got over a hundred suggestions and I was blown away by the creativity. It was a difficult decision to just pick one, but Mr. 4BL, I'm very intrigued to try the bacon jam wings. Mr. 4BL, DM me your address and I'll send you out some rub. I'm gonna taste test those bacon jam wings this week in the restaurant, and if the cooks and I like it, it's going on the menu. So Mr. 4BL, if you're in the Denver area, you gotta come in and try those bacon jam wings if we put them on the menu. My treat. Bingo. burgers just came off and they smell good they're looking righteous only one thing left to do and that's add the salty sweet tangy bacon bourbon jam it's the perfect complement to the savory beef and the decadent American cheese that just melts perfectly on this smash burger I like a nice heaping load of bacon jam almost as much as one patty so you got two parts smash burger, one part bacon jam. My mouth is literally watering right now. The anticipation, I can't take it. Now for my favorite part, the taste test. That's as good as it gets. It hits all the notes. It's sweet, it's savory, it's beefy, it's tangy. If you have a favorite smash burger, let me know down in the comments what it would be. I'd love to cook it and I love looking at your comments. If this looked good, if it's something you want to try, give me a thumbs up. Jason Ganahl, GQ Barbecue, and I'll see you on the next one.